what was left behind is barely standing. Documents and office furniture alike burnt to a cinder. A fire swept through the office of the deputy head teacher at Kamola Secondary School in Lusaka, and authorities are investigating the matter. In a statement, police spokesperson Ray Hamonga reveals that a collection of matchsticks was found at the scene, suggesting the fire was deliberately ignited. No arrests have been made so far. LCC Public Relations Manager Chola Mwamba says fire officers were sent to quench the inferno as soon as the distress call was sounded on Saturday morning. Stakeholders in the education sector are shocked, as this is the third fire incident recorded in a questionable manner at the same school. And I think we want to call upon law enforcement agencies to go flat out and get to the bottom and root of all this barbarity act. Uh, we condemn it in the strongest terms and we urge the Minister of Education to institute uh, a tribunal to investigate why Kamala Secondary School of all schools should be so prone to people gutting down that, that, that building or those, those infrastructure. And we want to go further and urge the ministry to possibly transfer the entire top management of that school. Area councillor Minda Simata is saddened by this. There are people that are behind it and uh, we are working with the school administration to ensure to say that uh, we get to the bottom of this issue. Otherwise it's a drawback, uh, government money has been lost, so we've been taken aback, the community has been taken aback. Efforts to get the school authorities proved futile by press time as they demanded clearance from relevant authorities before they could grant this reporter an interview. Penlop Sikazwe, ZNBC News, Lusaka.